Copernicus actually names. Recent detective work has uncovered clues that Copernicus based many of his ideas on the work of other Islamic scholars. The clearest example is Copernicus's use of a mathematical idea devised by the 13th century Islamic astronomer Al Tusi, called the Tusi couple. Back in England, I compared a copy of Al Tusi's Tezkirafi Ilm al Hayya with another edition of Copernicus's Revolutionibus. In it, there's a diagram of the Tusi couple and there's an almost identical diagram in Copernicus's book, even down to the letters that mark the points on the circles. So in El Tuzi, there's the Arabic Elif, which is A. There's the Ba, which is B. Jim over here is the G. And the Dal at the center, D. It's a remarkable similarity. Now, this might just be coincidence, but it's pretty compelling evidence. In fact, I truly believe that Copernicus must have been aware of Al Tuzi's work and other Islamic astronomers. Further detective work also shows that Copernicus used mathematical ideas for planetary motion that are remarkably similar to one.